So how did orthotics save me from hip surgery? It was May 2019 and I was working out and I hurt my hip doing CrossFit. It wasn't anything out of the ordinary. I did something to the hip, usually get adjusted and then ice it and then things are all right. Well, this time didn't go that way. It happened to be Memorial Day weekend, injured my hip, things progressively got worse throughout the week. We went camping a couple hours away from the house, got to the point where I couldn't walk. Uh, got back to the office, got adjusted, new x-rays, new everything, things uh, weren't getting better. I saw another chiropractor friend of mine and does a, does a completely different technique and things weren't getting better. I saw a couple different physical therapists, talking to my medical doctor, nine months of this. And we all came to the conclusion that we think it's a torn hip labrum. So my doctor says we have to do an arthrogram. If you don't know what an arthrogram is, where you take a big needle, shove it into your hip socket, fill it full of fluid, and then do an MRI. Well, that sounded terrible to me. But about the same time, a friend of mine had mentioned orthotics. And at that point, I always thought orthotics were just a bunch of hooey that chiropractors used for extra money in their office, but it, I was also willing to try anything. If someone said, hey, drinking goat pee might help, that I would have I would have considered it. So we ordered the 3D laser scanner, scanned my feet, got my orthotics in, and when I first put them in, those things were uncomfortable. These things were uncomfortable. These bumps that are in here, I felt like someone sawed off three golf balls, shoved them into my shoe, and I was walking around on it. But what happened, after two weeks, I was back in the gym working out pain-free. Spent nine months trying to fix it. Two weeks, I'm back in the gym. Well, how does that work? How, how, does, that, how does that happen?